Hi everybody, welcome to this new video of Cyrus Ray playing Baldur's Gate 2 with no party in the last save. In the previous episode, we managed to find uh, the uh, black uh, leopard claw that was requested for fulfilling exact, exact request. Um, and, uh, you know, we uh, managed to get out of, of the, uh, the tomb, managed to grab a few cool items, we sold it. And after we went back on our direction to the Five Flagons to try to solve the issue that we have with Eldadis. Now, as I explained, uh, what we were trying to do in the past is uh, we freed uh, Eldadis from uh, Mech Graph uh, Labyrinth, but because we didn't want to keep in the party because we are doing a solo uh, playthrough, um, it didn't join us. So I let him go, and the problem is that I gave him the gem, saying like, okay, well, you know, uh, this is what, you know, Ray will do, you know, uh, it will give him the gem so he can he can go at the uh, at the inn, um, and after I will find him back at the inn to talk to, to him later. But what ended up happening is doing a bug where Erdalis is not there, uh, where the, uh, the main characters uh, that we are supposed to talk to doesn't spawn, and uh, that's a big predicament, right? So the only way that, uh, that we can solve that bug is to actually activate the console and to put uh, two lines of command that are put in there to re, uh, re-pop Erdalis, because if we don't do that, then Erdalis will, will, will never be seen again. You will never ever be uh, able to see Erdalis in the fly flagons that you're supposed to, and therefore you will not be able to go in the sphere uh, the the planet sphere and you will not be able to do this entire quest just because of that bug. Like uh, it, it's normal if you don't if you cannot have Eldadis with you in the party and it goes back to the five flagons, that's normal. You're supposed to go back in the five flagons and talk to him again. The but the bug seems to be that if you give the gem to Eldadis, then it doesn't spawn. Okay. So we just regenerated him. Uh, I'm gonna show you the comments that I put. You need to uh, to activate the, the console. There are, there are good tutorials on how to do that. Um, and uh, you know, and I think I'm gonna some some from time to time. I'm just gonna use the the console just to resolve bugs like this. If uh, if we are supposed to uh, to do a quest and you know do we do something in a certain way and the game bugs that, like uh, in previous episode it literally crashed. When we're trying to seek for the 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 claw of the black leopard, the game crash, or you are supposed to to uh, to talk to our PC, but because you did it in a certain way, the game you know bugs and don't generate the PC, then we can use the console to solve the issue. So that's what I did, and now you know Eldadis is at the inn, and we're gonna talk to him again. So I am proud to be your prize, am I? A uh, mocking uh, a mocking bird to sing. Your, pri your pity prizes. So I'm just gonna redo that dialogue. Uh, if you want to go, I will not hold you to this deal. What are my choices? Uh, if you wish to join me, you may do so, but only as a free man. If you if you wish to go, then go. If you need help, I'm ready to assist you. Oh, your aggression is beyond belief and well beyond the vagaries of my circumstances. Uh, one such or uh, as you uh, should gladly join. I shall sing your praises without mockery. As far as for how you can help me, I can ask but one favor. Upon my capture, Macraft stole from me a most important gem. I uh, only have. Uh, I only have a haze recollection of it being in an altar here. I must find it again so it may return to its rightful owner, Miss Radis Shay, at the Sigil Theatre Troupe. Your help in uh, in this will mean a million words to me. The gem! We have it! Come, my birds, let us to the playhouse fly! The inn is in the bridge district of this city, in the basement of the Five Flagons. Okay. There you go. So Eldaris is with us. We have the gem, okay, as my we task, should. It shall be. And now, because we already did all this, we went, we went uh, in uh, Merkat's laboratory. We f we uh, did the quest for Merkat. We found the gem. We did everything. So this is the step where we should be without the bug. So here you go. Consider it done. So hopefully. Okay. 
Okay. Okay. They don't, they, don't, they don't seem to be there for some reason. Okay, so. Yeah, Shalis is supposed to be there. So if she's not there, again, that's another bug. Okay, let's. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just checking. It shall be. Consider Maybe what I will done. do, I will go out of the five flagons. Ah, the playhouse. It is in the basement of this inn. Come, let us enter. Ms. Reyes will be pleased to see the gifts we bring. Okay. So maybe that, that's best. the step that I need to go to generate yes. uh, the events. Very well. Yeah. Normally there's supposed to be a play, play there, but there's no play. I may gonna have to pop the character there as well, which is kind of annoying. Yeah. Okay. So just bear with me, guys. All right, guys. So cast? I generated those commands. So this, I found we should be able to say it. Here. Okay. So those are the commands that I put to solve the Eldadis bug, and this is the command that I put Aye, to solve the lifeblood of a city. <laughs> it ebbs and flows the same on any plane. Yep. And uh, those line of command to try to on see if we can spawn uh, Realis. Hopefully she should. Oh, yeah, she, she's Elise, there. Elise, you have returned. And who is this that you bring with you? My savior and my jello buff, it seems. Miss Realis, may I present Solaris Ray? And Solaris Ray, Miss Realis. Have you the gem, my brilliant hand? It is here, my lady. Resting safe with us. I uh, promised uh, these ravens of mine uh, you would reward them. Very well. I uh, have upon me seven seven hundred coin. Would that be enough? Uh, your purse is generous. Here then uh, is the stone you covet. Uh, is the stone you covet? Yeah. Um, and here is the seven hundred of the pity coin to which you focus your desire. How that is? Tell them that we are about. While I go prepare the stone for summoning. Yes, me right Miss Radis. Ah, my ravens. Uh there there be a tale between us that is long overdue. Forgive me if I led you to believe that uh, your gem was just a worthless blob for the stage. In truth, it is something uh, far more interesting, a planar jewel, a nexus between the astral plane and the prime material plane in which we are currently. Few of your prime would sense its presence, but uh, Merkaf did, and so it was that I fell into uh, his keeping. Luckily, he had not rid himself of it before your timely rescue. Okay. Prime and plan a draw and and what do you speak of that is like uh, have you lost me? Uh, <laughs> uh, for you have lost me. Uh, what is Radis summoning? A young conduit. What? To travel from between planes we birds of flight can pass from through what are called young conduits. Whipping snake-like snake -like tubes that live within the astral planes. They heed and, and their head and tails cling to different pieces of the multiverse. The planar stone acts like a charm of pap upon this conduit, bringing them to us uh, that we might enter and, and pass through. Miss Radis is uh, playing the stone as we speak so that our company might slip through our hunter's grasp and find another stage. The play must go on, you know. Here, Delise, everyone, gather around. This stone is ready to begin the summoning. Wow. 
as the country open, they will bring something with them. We will do what we can to hold off whatever beast comes, the better to determine uh, which road the safest. So I wish your presence here would be appreciated. Would you stay with us? We shall hold off these creatures as best as we are able. Uh, tell me when you find the right tunnel. Wherever you're ready, uh, Miss Radis. Okay. Awesome. Yes. Okay. Actually, it's maybe good at this stage to have my throwing axe. Uh, let's put that back in and grab the throwing axe, put it in throwing mode. By and... my honor, you shall not see another day. A dangerous ah. mistake. This time I will just, just go, just go back. What is my task? Yeah, it's immune to fire damage, but it's not immune to the damage of one. My honor. Hello. Let's take that they start. They start with you more damage. Take picture of the night. I trust all this with you. But the answer. Good day, Radis. Will you permit me to stop this madness? I trust all this with you. Thank you. Who are you? What and what business do you have uh, with us? Oh, just an employee of an old acquaintance of yours uh, in Sigil. Duke, what was his name? Darkwood? Yes, Duke Darkwood, but it, uh, what was it? Wasn't it? You really ought uh, have done that play, you know? We were set up. We performed it under the assumption that it was fiction. The playwright never told us otherwise. Oh yes, the, infer the infamous anonymous playwright. Now, who was he or, uh, anyway? He never did learn. Never did we. He wore a mask and met us, uh, met with us in the alleyway. It doesn't matter. Come, my uh, my bards. It appears it's time to make our reckoning. What of these others? Who are you, Afrok? Surely Raelis did not hire you in hope that you will save her. I will be willing to help, though I have no intention of stepping out. So, uh, if you want these people, you will have to get through me. Four. I don't need to inv uh, I don't need to involve you. Already, I have the souls of, of this one attuned. Let it begin. Ah. There you yes. Go. Consider it Let's done. Let's go to the plains. What can it be now? Awesome, guys. Now we are on our way to do the quest of the other plane in the pr pr uh, planet prison, which is super, super, super good. Uh, okay, just bear with me. Okay, so we are here. All right, so no, no, I don't care what you say. I won't be a slave anymore. Well, uh, if that's uh, the way you... Trail, hold. Others have come through the portal. What others? Ah, the primes. How fool foolish of you to have followed your active friends here. Vonif, close the portal, please. What can it be now? Hey, do you have any idea at all where you are, primes? It doesn't matter. I'm here to rescue my friends. How touching, truly. But your true tr your active friends are already in prison and uh, at the whim of of the Combian until they are transported to Duke. You are far too late to help them. This place is one of the finest prisons in the plains. There is no way out of here except at the whim of the Combian. What fools you must be to come here uh, of your own volition. 
no matter, I expect you will bring a grand prize uh, from the Cambion as new frowns. Uh, hunter, uh, hunter, take him. Okay. You deserve. Hmm. Okay, so there's a spell going up. What is that spell? Uh, cast Shadow Door. Okay, so I know that Shadow Door should be fine. So we're gonna go with this and we're gonna. By my honor, you shall not see another day! The uh, unfortunately, the uh, my... uh, this guy is just annoying. No! I, I'm sorry, that whole person, guys. Whole person. That's fine, it's fine. <sighs> If I if I know that he wants to to do a whole person, then uh... yes, it shall be. What can it be now? Okay. What is my task? You deserve no. <laughs> On my honor, Imperial, consider it done. I want this thing there. Yeah. Okay, so there's another UNT body hunter there. Um, save versus death. I think I should be. Oh. Yeah. Okay, for now I'm fine. I'm just checking what the spellcaster is doing. You deserve no less. Oh. You deserve no less than death. A dangerous okay. mistake. What is that? Disintegrate. Okay. I'll wipe your lineage right out of the realm. Okay, so this is a creature of the night, right? A dangerous mistake. What? Wow, that's domination. Yeah, I really need to take care of this other creature there. Yes, it shall be. What can it be now? What can it be now? I also could, uh, where is it? Do I have still a portion of invulnerability or not? No. I don't. I don't have a portion of invulnerability. But I could cast silence. Uh, magic protection. Yeah, I don't want to abuse this. I still have a, a, a scroll of magic protection, which is super powerful. Um, yeah, I'm gonna need to replenish in, in potions shortly. I still think that I have what it takes. Um, I could uh, use the simulac and all that stuff, but uh, I don't want to burn it. There's a lot of... Uh, things that I need to face in this uh, in this plane and definitely because we are under pressure uh, if I rest here I will increase the difficulty right so so I need to be thoughtful of how I want to play this um, I think I will use the the magic protection. That's gonna last for two hours. Oh, my task. Well. Okay. 
Okay, so I want to kill this guy and I want to kill this guy. Um, I could use also the jetty uh, creature, but um, yeah, let's use this. Okay, so here's that. Okay. So now, what I gotta do. Gotta take the stuff because it's my highest weapon. On my honor. Oh, that hurts, isn't it? And actually, I gotta do. Let's go. So let's do the. Oh, there you go. Now I'm gonna re switch. I think they are evil, so let's see if the. Day Star is gonna be good. Yeah, I think Day Star is gonna be perfectly fine. By my honor, you shall not see another day. Okay, here you go. Now that the special is gone. <laughs> what, you're insulting me? You're insulting me. Alright. Let's talk about this. I'll wipe, I'll wipe your filthy lips. I will do my best. Oh, look at this, guys. You, you wouldn't hurt a gnome, would you? I, I thank you, my lord, for your timely rescue. I'm afraid I did not give much thought as to what I would do after I removed my collar. Uh, it, it was foolish of me, I suppose, but I would rather be dead than remain a slave to the Cambion forever. There has to be a way uh, out of here somehow. What do you mean uh, by your collar? The warden keeps a large number of slaves here, prisoners that have been turned into thralls by magic magical collar, but uh, they wear that control them. They are next to impossible to remove. Mine had a small flaw in it, and I, I was able to squirm out of it uh, not long ago, only to find out that there was almost nowhere for me to go here, and danger down uh, every corner. What was this camion? Uh, you, what, what is that camion that you mentioned? The camion. The camion here is the warden of this prison. I know not his true name, but he is a cruel and evil master who delights in the suffering of his frowls. He is a powerful demon as well. You may have defeated his bounty hunters, but uh, he, if I were you, I will find a way out of here and avoid him entirely. Oh no 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 no! We we gonna uh, we gonna confront him heads on. You said that there is no way out of there. Surely that is incorrect. Um, the only uh, only sure way out of this planet prison is through the dark magic of the Combion himself. But I doubt that he would transport uh, anyone out of here willingly. There, uh, there be no physical exit that I know of. The portal leads only to another room within the prison. And there are no doors or windows. Uh, if indeed there is even an outside to speak of here. No, the only way uh, I, uh, the only way, way one can live the, is through the use of magic. 
powerful magic that uh, only a few might have to attract a conduit to this dim and forsaken place. Do you know where I met Fan Al Dadis in his trip? You are friends with the actors? Ah, then you may as well begin mourning them, my lord. They are in the warden cells, awaiting transport uh, to the Duke Warren's tower, to I'm told. The warden is directly north of here, through the hallway, but uh, I would advise against going down this that path. You will see one you will see one the floor uh, you will see on the floor uh marking that the tanui have less left uh, with their magic portals that transport you to the other room of this prison the one the ones in the hallway and to the north you cannot avoid and they bring you to the barrack where the warden keeps his personal soldiers and frau uh tis the most dangerous pass to take there's another way to reach the warden, a safer way, perhaps, uh, that may serve your purpose and uh, perhaps mine as well. May I tell you of it? Very well, I'm listening. The warden is, power, uh, is, is powerful by himself, true, but is also protected by many by the many frails under his uh, uh, control through the color they wear. The passage of the east uh, leads to the chamber of the Master of Frowls, a lesser tannery who holds a device that I, I know allows him to control the colors. Destroy the device and the frowls are free. The warden is vulnerable and I will be able to contact my newly freed friends and some of them are mages who will teleport us away. As well, uh, the portal uh, of the floor to the east may be avoided they lead uh, only to another uh, other cells, uh, I understand, and are full of not but violent and dangerous creatures. I I would not offer this chance, my lord. Uh, I would not offer this chance uh, if I did not think you might have a chance against the warden himself. I can't think uh, of another way for either of us to escape this place, truly. Why do I not? Uh, why do I not simply free your frowns and have them teleport us away? Why must I fight the warden? There are many old and powerful magic in these prisons, my lord. Uh, we might get away uh, briefly, but uh, the prison's magic will track us, and the warden will send powerful hunters very quickly. But uh, the prison's magic dies with uh, the warden. It is the only way. Very well. I will find the master frowns uh, and do as you suggest. Most excellent, my lord. Uh, luck is smiling on me. Truly, in fact, the mere chance for true escape arrive with you through that conduit. I wish you every success. Okay, so let's have a look. I'm not gonna grab the, the arrows, I don't really care. So we're gonna put that together. We, this is something to sell. This is to put in the jewelry bag. This is, uh, you know, artifacts and things like that. I think this is a cloak of protection, which is cool. You know, I put that here. Rest that. Yeah, that's fine. I want to loot every one of them. Ah, yeah, I remember this dagger. It's a, it's a, pro, um, a. A dagger that poison, and if I'm not mistaken, this is the boots of speed. Yep, there you go. So I already know what it was. So, you know, I, I know that it was not a cursed item. Okay, and we have something. So this this is perfect, guys. This is absolutely perfect. So we have the boots of speed. We have the boots of speed. Now, um, th this is very interesting. I want us to be able to clean this entire place and grab everything that we can because here we're gonna have the drinker, the, which is a long sword that's gonna help me as well uh, regenerate. Yes. For our leader. We, we attack them, attack them, uh, attack, uh, kill them all. Okay, um, sure. 
<sighs> I, I love Daystar, but not evil. I don't think that Daystar would be uh, good in there. Uh, this is, protects me from immobilization, which would be good if I have the Shield of Harmony. For now, we're gonna do this. Yes. Go in throwing mode. Yes. Come closer. Okay, I gotta throw. Interrupt the casting. A solid hit. Sorry. Yeah, but if it's just obeying hit. orders, like, uh, so you know, like, um, Ray feels a little bit sorry for him. Ah, uh, that, that's the color. Yeah, 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 yeah. We don't, we don't want to wear this. Ah, uh, this is a normal shell, we don't care. Now, the good thing for us is like because of the ring, we don't need to rest. We can regenerate. So I'm gonna go north, I'm gonna go east, I'm gonna explore the entire place. We can activate this to go to somewhere else. Can I assist you? We must protect the warden's pet. Okay. Yes. He would be uh it would be ever so angry if anything happens to his ferret. Hey, uh, away with you, prisoner. Return to your cell, or the warden will be most depleted. What is my very well? Ooh, this is confusion. This is confusion. Okay, uh, okay. I'm gonna use the potion of clarity. As it. Potion of clarity, and we're gonna drink it immediately. On my honor. All right, so we Done. resisted it. All right, let's go. Oh, oh that's a pet. Hmm, vermin, I see. Come, my pretty frowns. Uh, these are no escape prisoners. These are invaders. We must destroy them uh, for my master. <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna use uh, an enhance. Yes. All right, go. All right. Oh. 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 Yeah, I mean, we don't go to disease and oh. have to poison, I think. Hold on, something is hitting me very hard. Oh. A dangerous mistake. Okay, so th those are evil creatures, so I think they, they start with... A uh, solid hit. Pretty good against them. Oh. There we go. That's right. Okay, the last one. I tell you, Ray is getting so strong. There you go. As you ask. So the only reason why I drink I drink that potion is because ah, uh, Shrumps, I wanted to uh, to save, but I don't think I will be able to save now. Okay, let's go in this face. Okay, I'm may gonna need a. Uh, I'm may gonna need the. Uh, what is my task? Oh. Oh. A dangerous mistake. I require assistance. It shall be. I require assistance. Hey, yeah. <laughs> uh, 
What did she do? Oh, no. She hasn't done a, a, a stone skin or something like that. Okay, I'm getting dangerously low. On my honor. I shall not yield to you. There you go. Yeah, now that the caster is dead, like, it's going to be easy for us. Sorry. Yeah, I'm going to need to let the ring out, which is right us. It's going to be important. Consider it done. Okay, so we have portions of extra healing. Gonna put it there. Bunch of, of stuff. So this is gonna be very worth it for us, guys. Very worth. What is that? A long sword or a short sword? Is that short sword? Okay. And I think this is the um, the gauntlet of of uh, of mastery. But I don't know. I don't. I don't want to. This is a ring of protection, obviously. Um. So we're gonna save. On. Okay. What is this? The woven perch twitches as if it it leaves, and it's soft and organic to the touch. Okay, that's fine. Okay, so now there is another portion there. Um, yeah, I mean the ring is regenerating us pretty pretty good, but it's gonna take time. But now that we have the boots of speed, guys, like wow, we're gonna be able to um, uh, we're gonna be able to travel uh, so fast. We're gonna be able to be like Sonic. I think I think we can activate this, but I just want to clean the entire place. Oh, there is uh, uh, something that I didn't check. I was gonna say, you know, it's there. Okay, there's a bunch of arrows and oh, there's a... Uh... Yeah, why not? I mean, uh, since I'm, I'm uh, healing... Oh no! I went into the room! No! Didn't want to. Okay, or drink a potion. I await your word. Yeah. It shall be. Yeah, okay, so there, here I can't see. Sonic Blast. I should be protected, but I just gotta put that. Yeah, let's take the day. Boom. Day star. Dangerous mistake. What, let me sleep? Okay. Okay. Come on, Ray, wake up. Yes. Die for this. Jeez. Consider it done. Okay, portion of healing. That's great. There's, we have some portions of extra healing, which is good. Yeah, I didn't want to. I, I didn't want to go there. I didn't want to to action this, but uh, wow, that was that was close, guys. That was very close. So <laughs> the ring is slowly regenerating gas, but that, that is that is why this ring is so powerful. I could have a better regeneration with the troll, but I don't want to, to waste that item. That being said, if I don't want to use the transformation, I think I would be way better off using the cloak of protection because that's gonna give me better, better saving throws. You know, so as a fighter, and this is what I really, really love about the fighters. You really need to optimize every single piece of equipment that you have. But if you do, you can maximize 
every single one of them, and especially weapons, right? Because you can have any weapons and you can be master of specific weapons or being, you know, able to, to um, wield a big, a, a good variety of them while still being efficient, right? So that's two different choices. So there's many things that you can do with the fighters. It's, it's an amazing class. I really love it. Um, I really love uh, wizards too, but fighters are pretty good. Okay, so we lost something there. I, f I don't think it's... Oh, Shanks, don't tell me that it's the clarity portion. Effect. Yeah, I think we are, we don't have the clarity uh, potion effect anymore, which can be a big problem for us. We have magic resistance, 50%, but it doesn't necessarily mean that, that it's going to be enough. Okay, so we have a... Oh, the Master of Frowls. Here you go. You, you are the one who have brought such disruption to this prison in my Frowls, eh? Well, this will end... Uh, was, this will be the end of that. Okay. Elementals. Okay. Nice. Okay, so he's bringing elementals. A dangerous mistake. Okay, so I can I can hurt them. That's why I wanted to be sure. If I can hurt them while not taking too much damage, I can regenerate. That's why the drinker would be good to have, actually. Oh, I leveled up again. Wow, guys, we are level we are level 15. It's a huge level for us. Level 15. Yes, we leveled up. So now. We have a specialization point, and this is very important. Okay, but I, I think that we're gonna go long sword, right? Now, there is also another thing, and you can see like level 15 is such a huge level. You see, one additional weapon proficiency, all our saves are reduced by one, which is good. We have plus one to hit, of course, plus three hit points, plus one lore, but that specialization, guys, that specialization. So, this is the occasion for us to either being more fun to be more proficient at the long sword, or the axe, you know, um, or the long bow. The long bow I tend to use it less now, um, uh, which is fine. I may not even put an extra point in there to be quite honest. But there is also the possibility to develop, you know, two a uh, two weapon style, right? To have two two uh two weapons, or two-handed weapon style, right? Um, which, if we look at what it does, you know, like the weather have plus one to the damage, not to hit, just to the damage, uh, and minus two to the speed factor, and increase the crit, the crit chance. And a second point uh, will give uh, a further minus two to the speed factor, and that will work for any two-handed weapon like the staff. It will work for the two-hand axe and for the albard. So without having being proficient with those weapons, uh, you will you will be able to do more damage and to hit more and having more chance to crit. You know, so that's that's not a bad trade-off. It is not a bad trade-off. Um, the two uh, the two weapon style that requires three points to be very good at it, right? Like if you put just one point. You know, uh, you're still gonna have huge penalties, so that's why I don't want to put too much, too much into that. But we will, we will think about it. We will think about it. Uh, for now, I think um, improving our chance to hit with the long sword is gonna be, uh, is gonna be good, um, because that's gonna, we're gonna have more and more long swords, guys, and the long swords that we're gonna have. Are gonna be good, <laughs> you know. Now I'm not gonna have um, a, a long sword plus four. I think before front of bar. So that that's the only thing that I'm, you know, thinking. Like they are, they, we have a staff plus four already. So that's why I'm thinking about this. But you know, ah. 
There is also this uh, this uh, dagger that is super good, you know. Uh, having one point in dagger would be uh, would be good. So we don't have the penalty, but I don't want to spread myself too much uh, because it's a is a is a dagger plus three that has a drinker effect and that can stun. I mean, it's amazing, guys. It's amazing. It's a it's a very good uh, a very good one. But as I said. Ah, this is so this is so difficult. This is, this is such a crucial point. We we're gonna need to think about this. I may even pause the video here to be honest to think about this. But the original strategy is to put five points of mastery in the long swords, okay? Because that's gonna make us a beast with the long swords, right? A real beast. And we need that because since we we are uh, we are using we are mastered uh, mastering the the shields, then we really need to make sure that whatever weapon we are wielding in one hand, we are very good with it, right? And that's gonna like the third point is gonna give us you know um, plus two to hit on top of what we already have, right? Plus one damage, right? So, you know, plus two to hit, plus one damage is not bad at all, right? Another point, it's gonna be uh, plus one damage and minus one to the speed factor. And another point would be another point to the damage, minus three to the speed factor. And we have an extra round, uh, an extra attack per round. So, you know, that, that's the reason why, you know, like we want to go with something like absolutely, uh, absolutely bonkers on that. Um, with the, with the long swords. Um, unfortunately the axe is like the, the good axe, the very, very good axe, the, the axe of the unyielding, we're not going to have it before the very end of front of battle. So that's why I'm not putting points in there. Uh, the short, the long bow, it's good, but I'm, I don't think it's necessary to put additional points there because I'm not using it that much. And it's going to take three points to master this. But you see, like the, the problem of having two, two weapon style Right, I think two weapon, uh, not two weapon style. Two weapon style is three points. That's too, way too much. But two handed weapon style is just two points, and in in that will work with anything that is two handed. You know, like a quarter staff, uh, you know, two handed swords and alberts. You know, uh, all that. You know, albert is two weapon, uh, two handed weapon. So it's gonna make us decent with those weapon, even if. Uh, we are, will have a penalty to weld it. We we gonna be uh you know. We're gonna be able to uh, to to hit more and having a more chance to create, but still, I mean, I I want to go specialization long sword. Um, it's it's a shame if I if I I would like to go two handed weapon because then I can I have two long swords or having a, an axe and a long sword or things like that or maybe even a dart. You know, uh, so I will see, but I'm gonna need three points. I'm gonna need three points for the long sword. That's for sure. And after that, so three points. So this is gonna be level 15. The other one is 18. The other one is 21. Uh, and after that, I still, after 21, I still have 24, uh, 27, 30, 33. 36 and 39. So I'm just gonna have six points, guys. Six points. Alright. It's still it's still good. But if I don't want to, to put an additional point in the long bow and in the axes, um, I can use those six points to put three points in the dual welding. And after maybe, you know, uh maybe I don't know. One point in dagger and two points in short swords, so I can slash, 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 you know, uh, slice, slice like that, or uh, you know, I can put two points in the two-handed weapon style, and then uh, you know, uh, I will have still four points, so I could put one point in 
quarter staff um, and and maybe three points in a two-handed sword because we have some pretty good two-handed sword too. Um, or maybe, f you know, four points in gra uh, in, uh, in the swords. And that, that will make us like killing machines with a two-handed two-handed weapons and I think it's not necessarily a bad uh, bad thing you know because when we are fighting spare casters the truth is I don't necessarily need the shield that much unless I have the shield of harmony uh, to protect myself against effects right but if I have a scroll of magic protection or things like that then you know the, the, the shield is not necessarily going to be super efficient right there are some shields that can potentially, um, I mean, the, the, the cloak of mirroring is a cloak. It's not a shield. Um, so if you are fighting in melee with other characters, then yeah, you're going to need to have the sword of, uh, the shield of saving grace. You can have the shield of harmony. Um, but if you are facing a hundred percent spare casters or people that are not very good at hitting you in melee, then you can go in two handed weapons and, and just go out there and murder them, right? Murder them. Um, so it's something to, to think about. But uh, uh, I also like the two, two, weapon, two, two weapon style, but the problem is it's going to make me burn so many points just to be decent with this, right? And after that, I'm going to need, uh, I'm gonna need to, to put at least some points with different styles, like maybe one point in dagger and maybe two points in short sword, right? Uh, short sword, sorry, right? Or I can put one point in short sword, one point in daggers and one point in uh, katana. In katana, uh, which is gonna give me a, a pretty good spread. I'm not gonna be uh, very proficient with, uh, with them, but uh, I will not have a penalty minus two if I use it in my prime weapon. And in my second hand, I will have a minus two, but it will be compensated with my, like if I put a long sword in my se my second hand, uh, the penalty would be outweighed. The minus two penalty would be outweighed uh, from the two-handed weapon here. Right? So the offhand will have a, a minus two, but the, the main hand will have a zero. Right? And then... You know, I will have so much bonus to hit with the long sword. <laughs> so I'm gonna be a killing machine on the left, on the off weapon, and on the main weapon, I will I will just have my basic attack plus the bonus of the weapon. And but I think it could work, you know. But anyway, regardless, I want to go mastery long sword, so I'm gonna go long sword. All right, done. There you go. Which means that now we are more dangerous with long swords. Okay. Uh, so I made my choice and I think I'm gonna save and we're gonna pause here and on the next episode We're gonna continue our uh, Navigation into the, the planet prison. So thank you very much guys for watching I hope that you enjoyed the series so far if you do please leave a like and subscribe That will really help the channel and don't forget to hit that notification bell to be aware when I put new content and I will catch you on the next video. Bye